everybody. How are my dear friends doing today? Everyone's doing good. I'm so glad to hear everybody's doing fine. So during the summer days, we plant a lot of seeds to grow little flowers and little plants and make our garden all colorful, right? So th that's why I decided to read a book called Planting a Rainbow. So we can learn the names of some flowers and see how the little seeds can turn into colorful flowers. Every year, mom and I plant a rainbow. In the fall, we buy some bulbs and plant them in the ground. So we go to the garden center and we bought a lot of little bulbs. So there's an orange tiger lily bulb, there's a red tulip bulb, orange tulip bulb, yellow daffodil bulb, blue hyacinth bulb, purple crocus corm, and purple bearded iris rhizome. We learned a lot of new names for the flowers today, right? Good. We ordered seeds from catalogs and wait all winter long. There's a folix, morning glory, zinnia, aster, cornflower, marigold, and daisy flowers. They all look so pretty, aren't they? For spring to warm the soil and sprout the bulbs. The tulips are growing little by little, daffodil, hyacinth, crocus, tulips and daffodil and hyacinth and more crocus plants are all in the ground, right? Then it's time to go to the garden center to select some seedlings. There's a poppy seeds, there's a delphinium, violet, pansy, fern, and carnations. We sow the seeds and set out to plant in the soil. There's a tiger lily, carnations, aster, marigold, zinnia, parsley, poppy seeds, fern. There's so many different flowers and seeds that we planted, right? And watch the rainbow grow. This looks so nice, right? Imagine all these little plants are in your garden. Wouldn't it look awesome? And they're growing. And when they grow, they have nice, pretty, colorful flowers. We have some red flowers, like rose and carnations, and some orange flowers, like tulip and tiger lily and poppy. And we have some yellow blooms like daisy and marigold and daffodils. We grow something green too, like ferns, right? And some blue flowers like morning glories and hyacinth and corn flowers. And some purple flowers too. Crocus, folix, iris, and pansy. All summer long, we pick them and bring them home. What does it look like to you guys? What is this? A flower bouquet, right? We could give this flower bouquet to our dad on Father's Day or our mother on Mother's Day, right? Or just have the nice bouquet in our kitchen, right? On our dining table. Wouldn't that look pretty? You guys agree with me? Thank you. It was fun reading the book with you guys. Bye for now. Love you guys.